Windows 10 has officially ended support on October 14th of 2025. A peak when Microsoft made Windows usable after their mistakes from Windows 8 and 8.1 respectively. Although the suggestion would say upgrade to Windows 11, not everyone can use it as the majority of computers that are running Windows 10 often don't always have something known as trusted platform module or TPM for short, which is a chip that Windows 11 is required in order to be able to use the computer. And supposedly this was used to keep your system secure. But realistically, there are ways around it to where you don't need to have this to upgrade to Windows 11. Tools like Rufus makes it possible to remove that TPM requirement. Another option you can use is something like Revision, where you can de-bloat your system and get rid of all the unnecessary crap and even implement some privacy features or even have a better gaming experience. But let's say you still want to stay with Windows 10, for instance, or you can always set a VPN to connect from the EU. Or if you want to completely ditch Windows, you can use something like Linux, as there are many different distributions to choose from. And depending on what you're going to need the computer for, you should pick one Linux distribution that is better suited for your needs. I personally would recommend using an Arch-based distro like Kashi OS for absolute beginners if you want to be able to play Steam games. Or if you just need a computer to use the internet or do office work or super basic stuff you would typically need a computer for, Linux Mint is also also another good choice for absolute beginners. There's definitely a lot more you can do with Linux, like customizing it to your heart's content and make it do amazing things. I, on the other hand, use a distribution called Arch, by the way. It is not ideal to use Windows 10 on the internet, so if something breaks, you're basically on your own. From the looks of it, Windows is kind of a dying platform in terms of usability. It's only a matter of time until the penguin takes over. There probably may be more mainstream options like Mac, but I would also ill-advise as it's considered locked down and no better than Windows. You definitely don't want to connect to the internet when 